so Nika Koopa, and the name of my business is Unika Koopa's Natural Touch. The services I provide are basically braiding, hair styling of particularly any texture, um, crocheting, styling of dreadlocks, natural styling, treatments for natural hair, or any particular um, hair texture, and also I provide makeup. I started off braiding hair since I was probably 10 years. I would practice and braid my own hair, then I would braid my sister's hair, my mom's hair, any close relative, and they were my first set of mannequins. I pursued mass communications, a degree in mass communications at Costat and also journalism and public relations. Part of my mass communication studies included a particular course um, named communication via social media and it was because of this particular course that I started off this business via social media and during the course of time it expanded right into an actual business. I did tutorials and whether it be photographic tutorials or video tutorials and I posted it to help people to learn um, how to do it yourself. My parents support me a lot in this venture and because I had that particular support I was able to innovate and really think long term so my plan was to execute right a professional salon if you have a business it's always important to register that business because you tend to see when you start getting a lot of likes or comments you tend to see your next page with your particular name or um, someone else promoting something that you started but you did not register so that's one of the things that I took into consideration I registered my business time is very important to me or any business person in general so if you know the people you surround yourself with which are your Facebook friends the people on social media that you would interact with if you know what are their interests whether it be baking whether it be a particular skill that you're good at doing nails doing hair selling clothing what designing all of that you capitalize on that